Um, you'll be wondering why I'm doing a makeup video. It is because I am really behind in Vlogmas. I do my makeup every day. I was going to do this look anyway. So I thought, why not just film it? Everyone loves a red lip. So yeah, if you don't want to watch a makeup tutorial, then just stop watching. Simple! <laughs> I hope you enjoy it. Step number one for making you so beautiful. <laughs> Um, I'm going to put moisturiser on to protect my skin from all the stuff that's about to be put on it. Right, next is primer. Primer, I used a professional from Benefit and it literally just smooths your skin out so you look like a Barbie doll. It's a lifesaver. Okay, so now that your skin no longer looks like skin, <laughs> it's time to put your foundation on. I used the Born This Way Too Faced, literally just started using it. Zoe, if you're watching this, it's great. I'll now know if you watch my videos, if you answer to this. <laughs> um, it's very full coverage, but that's exactly what I wanted because I don't wear foundation during the week. So I wanted people to not be able to recognize me at the weekend. I've also wetted my wee sponge, otherwise known as a beauty blender. Right, next up is the Wondrous Concealer. I use the Maybelline Anti-Age Eraser Eye. loose face powder on underneath my eyes because I'm going to be out all day and I can't be bothered with my concealer coming off. I'm not one of those people that can reapply their makeup throughout the day. I just forget. So it kind of just keeps it all there. <laughs> cheeks and then I'm gonna wipe away this dust here. I believe it's called baking. Highlighters. Highlight is where highlighters are the best thing that's ever happened to makeup. Just having that glow on your face is just the best. I can't, like, I sometimes go over the top on the glow because it makes you sparkle. <laughs> so I'm gonna first put on What's Up from Benefit. Now, I do like highlighter, so I'm gonna put on a second highlighter. It's the Becca Champagne Pop. This cost me an arm and a leg, so it better make me look beautiful. I'm using this brush that looks like a fan. I believe it is called a fan brush. <laughs> Next up is blusher. This is a pain in the ass because it's so big I can't carry it with me anywhere. However, it's great. It was quite cheap and you get like all the benefit blushers. I'm going to use Dallas because it's my go-to. It's like the only one I use. Eyebrows. What would we do without eyebrows? They're just the thing, aren't they? I used to use Anastasia Beverly Hills, but as mentioned before, makeup's extortionate and I can not buy a new one. You can also only get it in America, like all good things. So, I went for the UK alternative, I think which is the Brow Beater from Urban Decay. It's easy to use, like it's good when you can just like on your eyebrow. <laughs> Eyeliner. I only use Rimmel. It's my favorite. I will not use anything else. I've used Kat Von D, I've used Tarte. They're all rubbish. None of them are good. Everyone's lying to you. <laughs> this is gonna go inside my eye. It's like cream. 
So it's like skin colored, but it makes your eyes look a lot bigger, which I love. I love having eyes that look huge. So I'm gonna pop a tiny bit of mascara on and then I'm gonna put my eyelashes on because I'm going out for a nice lunch and I wanna look kinda glam. Glam! The mascara I use is the Telescopic Extra Black from L'Oreal and the eyelashes I use are the Demi Wispies from Arda. <laughs> size of lips but I still like to overdraw them. I don't know why, I just do. I'm using Ruby Woo in pencil and lipstick. It's the classic red. It's just my go-to red for everything. And I, I, I think it's the kind of lipstick that suits everyone as well. So, kind of smells like vanilla too. I've never noticed that before. <laughs> Touches the cherry on top. <laughs> mascara, by the way, if that's the answer, mascara. Okay, and that's me done. That's my festive red lip. Um, I hope you enjoyed this. Sorry, it's a makeup one, but I'm really behind on Vlogmas, so. Yeah, if you enjoyed this, remember to like, subscribe, and share. Beauty bloggers normally do a slow-mo at this point, don't they? Do they?